Now back to football. And this Wednesday, the former Bristol City and Swindon striker Christian Roberts has a testimonial game at the county ground. Christian, you're obviously going to benefit from this, but who else is going to benefit? Um, cancer research. You know, um, I lost my father to cancer in October. So when the game was arranged and you know everything was put in place, I just felt that it was a good deed that I would link myself in, in connection with uh, the cancer research. And yeah, they will donate. I'll make a donation, you know, uh, from the game. Now your former manager Dennis Wise famously promised you and your family a holiday if you got 20 goals in the season that he started off in charge. Now he didn't quite make it, but he's turning up on Wednesday, so that's a good, good uh, second best, really. It is. You know, um, it was a great gesture at the time, and you know, it gave me the uh, the enthusiasm to get back into football. Um, it, it didn't plan off, obviously. You know, I didn't get the 20, but you know, on Wednesday night, hopefully, you know, it, it'll all uh, you know come off and. The game will go well. It'd be nice to see him again. You know, Gus has been doing some work for me, so I'm looking forward to it. Now, we followed your progress uh, over recent years of your recovery from alcohol addiction. Now, that's obviously going well, but have you managed to help other people since then? Well, with, uh, you know, alcoholism and things like that, it's everyone helps everyone. You know, um, I've still got a great link with the, the treatment centre I went to. And when people are coming out of the treatment centre and they're based in Wales, I normally get a phone call to, to introduce them to the, to the meetings and where things are. And then you sort of let them go off and find their own path. And uh, like you say, it's worked and, you know, we, we all help each other. That's the, that's the main thing. Now, briefly, uh, obviously this will help you and your family in the future. But, I mean, your career ended very suddenly. But is enough done to help prepare footballers for after what is a very short career? There is enough done, you know, um, it also, some of the responsibility lies on the, the player himself, you know, with myself, my career was ended overnight, you know, and, uh, you know, then I fell into what I do now, looking after young footballers with a company ba back home in Wales. But there yeah. is, if you want to do it, you know, there's a, there is uh, things in place. Chris, thanks very much indeed. Best of luck on Wednesday night and kickoff is at 7.05. Real. Now then, there is a lot to talk about in sport tonight, including a star-studded benefit game featuring some Chelsea legends at Swindon Town. And we hear from Dan Ward-Smith on deciding to leave Bristol Rugby. So, to the county ground now and John Maguire. John. David, thank you. A good few thousand people here at the county ground tonight. Give us a cheer, folks. Yeah. They're in good spirit and I can tell you why they've come to see a star-studded Chelsea 11 here tonight. Some of the names uh, to give you here. Graeme Lasso, Dennis Wise, Clive Walker, Roberto Di Matteo, Gus Poyo and Gianfranco Zola. All here for Christian Roberts' benefit match tonight. We'll have a quick chat with him in just a second. If you're thinking of, if you're a Rovers fan or a Swindon fan and you're thinking of coming here on April the 25th for the big derby game, the money raised here is going to be given to the Help for Heroes campaign. That's the charity uh, that uh, donates money to servicemen and servicewomen injured in Iraq and in Afghanistan. Uh, the two managers of the club, Paul Trollope and, uh, and Danny Wilson, were present here today to, to launch it. There was also another launch today, uh, a little bit further down the road at Bristol, Bristol City, to commemorate 100 years since the club played in the FA Cup final. They lost to a team called Man United, whatever happened to them. The event was launched today with City legends Paul Cheesley and Jerry Sweeney dressed in replica kit from a century ago. The Robins lost 1-0 against Man U, their main rivals at the time, the first FA Cup final for both teams. United went on to appear in 17 more, and I'm sure they haven't finished yet. Back here then at the county ground, let's have a chat with the stars of the show here tonight. First, Christian, quite a turnout, you must be chuffed. Yeah, and I'm over the moon, you know, uh, it's been a long time planning, but I'm just happy that we finally got here. You know, the weather held out this time and I'm looking forward to it. Gus Boyer, Gus, uh, welcome back to the county ground. I know yeah. that you've been a, a prime mover in all of this. Is it difficult to get all these stars to turn out for you? Well, it wasn't uh, too much because, you know, first because of Christian, after because we, we love to play each other, you know, every now and then. And, uh, and also because it's for a good charity. So even if it's a few, they fail at the end, it's going to be a, a great evening. Should be a good evening. And ju just to say that that charity is Cancer Research. Dennis Wise, welcome back to you as well to the county ground. Uh, how often do you get to turn out for something like this these days? I don't, to be honest. I, I don't do a lot of this. And uh, it's only because Christian's asked us. And obviously we had him when we was at Swindon. And we had good times with him and he enjoyed himself. So um, we've come along to help him out, really. And that's what it's about, I think, tonight. And uh, we're pleased that we're here. All right, gents, I'll let you go and warm it up. It is a chilly night. Thanks yep. very much. Enjoy the evening. The football fans turned out to watch some big names play in tonight's benefit match for the former Swindon player Christian Roberts. 
The star-studded Chelsea Eleven in their pink strip took on a Swindon team at the County Grand to raise money for Roberts and for cancer research. A hat-trick by Zola saw the Chelsea team win 3-2.